السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome to our third online lesson for summer term 2 Last week uh, we learned from Prophet Ibrahim a.s. story different lessons What I would like you to do have two minutes and read this yourself جزاكم الله خير so today's lesson, inshallah, your LO is to learn how Prophet Ibrahim السلام, used evidence to show that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the creator. When Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala commanded the fire to be peaceful and cool, the fire did not burn Prophet Ibrahim السلام. Instead, he walked out of the fire safe and unharmed. This was another evidence of the power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In a previous lesson, we learned that Prophet Ibrahim السلام, used evidence to show his father and the idol worshippers that the idols are powerless. And this lesson, inshallah, we will explore how Prophet Ibrahim السلام, used evidence again to show that planets and the stars are powerless as well. And they all Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Allah's creation. Prophet Ibrahim السلام, and the stars. One day at night, Prophet Ibrahim السلام, looked at the sky. When he saw the colorful stars, he said, maybe the stars is my Lord. And remember, he is using this as a plan to show the people that the stars are not the Lord. He just wants the people to think. But when the stars disappear, he said, I don't like those that disappear. About this, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Prophet Ibrahim السلام, and the moon. When Prophet Ibrahim السلام, showed the people that the stars could not be our Lord, he then showed them that the moon could not be our Lord. And when he saw the moon, he said that the moon is bigger than the stars. It's perhaps the moon could be our Lord. And about this, Allah Azza wa said, and after that, Prophet Ibrahim السلام, saw the sun. And when he saw the sun rising, he said, This is my Lord, this is greater. But when it set, he said to the people that I'm free from what you are worshipping. I am just only worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And about this, Allah Azza wa said, Prophet Ibrahim السلام, believes after what Prophet Ibrahim السلام, experienced with the stars, the moon, and the sun, he showed the people that it doesn't matter how bright the stars are, how big the moon and the sun are, they are still powerless and they could only be created by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now let us recap what we have learned in today's lesson. Prophet Ibrahim السلام, used evidence and logic evidence to explain to the worshippers of the planets that the stars, moon, and the sun are not our Lord. Prophet Ibrahim السلام, used evidence to show the people that the stars and the moon are powerless. 
Prophet Ibrahim Hassan talked kindly to the people when he explained for them that the stars and the planets are powerless. And finally, that the stars, moon, nor the sun, and or any other planets could be our Lord. Only Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is our Lord. He created the heavens and the earth. Your activity for this week, I would like you to correct these statements for Adil. Adil wants to tell his older sister Asila the story of Prophet Ibrahim alayhi salam. He has some of the information mixed up. Could you please write them correctly and help Adil out? Remember, all of these statements are incorrect. I'm looking forward to seeing your work through the class dojo. See you inshallah next week with another lesson. Assalamu alaikum.